Masky had a rough night last night, had one of his episodes about 3 a.m. So I informed the master and he said it was okay to let him sleep in a bit. I cover him up, as he has a bad habit of kicking off his covers and then getting too cold. I leave the room to go make us some breakfast. I'm kinda in the mood for French toast. Hopefully I don't burn it this time. I'm surprised they let me anywhere near a stove, considering I once burned cereal. But I digress. After the French toast is ready, I make Masky a tray and head back to our room. I pass by Toby looking extremely suspicious, and notice he is hiding something behind his back. Toby, what are you doing? Nothing. Why do you ask? Well, last time you were lurking around our door, my bear and Masky's books went missing, and I couldn't sleep for a week. Nah, it's nothing like that. P -p Promise. <laughs> Okay, you demented little snot. What are you up to? Nothing, he says, squirming. Just then a strange buzzing sound comes from behind his back. Toby, what's that noise? A really big bee? Sure it is. What's behind your back, Tobias? I demanded as I grabbed both his wrists, making him drop the clippers he was hiding behind his back. Well, care to explain? I asked the giggling proxy. I was feeling naughty.